hello, hello everybody. I hope you've all had a wonderful t month, basically. I know I've been gone a while, so it's nice to be back. I'm gonna try and enjoy what few stream dates that I have left. So, uh... That is what we'll be doing. I am thinking about just trying to beat La Mulana 2 uh, before I have to stop streaming so that it's just one less thing that is on my mind and I know I'll forget if I don't finish it because it'll be a while before I get to play it again. But, uh, for now... We have adventures to do. Oh, and I just realized I uh, mislabeled two things. Uh, I need to fix this. I finally took the time to uh, save all the maps you've been s sending me, uh, Ray, and setting them all up with the right names and the order in which I've encountered them. So it'll be easier to flick through them and know which ones I'm going into. I just uh, didn't remember which all which ones were di which areas, so po I kind of had to look through my notes a little bit and kind of puzzle it together. A, a good warm up. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. With that all being said, let's get over to the game. Let me make sure it's being shown. Cool. And, yeah. Time for you to load the game. Okay. We're all the way in the beginning room. With the Dark Star Lord's mausoleum. Um, do you remember what the last thing I did was, Ray? Because I sure don't. Yeah, this music is really good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you you can go ahead and do that, I guess. I really should have prepared a little bit more, but here I am. Uh... Maybe? I remember fighting the boss. Yeah, I remember fighting it, that. But I don't remember going where I was going from there and what I got from it. Hmm. 
Yes, while star guy stargazing. Let me look over my notes a little bit. Was it a mantras thing? Because... Yeah, probably. But I also have this note here that says, We will forfeit the earth for the power of heaven. We will rise to the sky by way of the Dark Star Lord's Pyramid. And that's making me think I need to do earth, heaven, and then sky, but I don't have sky. Also, going over my notes a little bit before stream made me realize that I think the way to the underworld is in a previous boss room. Yeah, it, it's uh, where Vidofnir waits, which is one of the bosses we killed. Encant the oof, words in the midst of the ominous twisting swelter, the two words that will illuminate day and night. That will lead you to Underworld Gate, where Vidofnir waits. But I could be wrong. Uh, like what, Ray? What is there left for me to do? Did I end up getting that thing from- that one thing from Valhalla? Yeah, thanks for the help, Ray. I, I appreciate it. Ow. I need to remember all the buttons again. Ow. It's over here, that. Aha! I didn't get this yet because I need the seal. Remember. I remember there was something there, at least. Destiny tablet. I do not have the Destiny tablet, I don't think. No, doesn't look like it. Because it looks like I need the Destiny tablet and the 
and this, the pyramid crystal, to be um, to a pedestal of prayer, and then I have to speak words of fealty to the Dark Star Lord. Let, let me uh, get that head pats for you. There we go. Um, I remember the tablet room in which I needed to use these footprints from the other place to figure out all of the um, mantras that make up the words of fealty. But I don't have some of those mantras yet, so I can't do that. Uh... Aren't the Locopala? No, it's not who I thought it is. A little bit, but not enough that um, I really remembered any directions that I was going in. Yeah, things do jump out, yeah. So once I have the uh, Destiny tablet the and the Crystal Pyramid, as well as the worlds of fealty, then I need to go to the top of the Star Lord's pyramid to get to the next zone, or a place called Nibiru. I need a slight weight for something. Um. I remember there not being much that I can do in Heaven's Labyrinth. Because I needed to wait till I do something else somewhere else to get the, those gates to open and let me into the rest of the zone.
Oh yeah, didn't I need money to save a fairy? Like we found where the other fairy dealer or market guy was. Right, those are there so that I can, uh, charge my thing. gold. What's up? Thanks for uh, thanks a lot for buying me back. You can call me Alruna, the treasure fairy. My power is the manipulation of probability. That pot may be empty, but what if there's money inside? I can boost your chance of hitting the jackpot, so basically I'm here to help you make bank. Come on, let's go. And then I squished myself. <laughs> I should have just warped out. Yup, squish. Oh. Hi, Fi Fi. It's nice to see you. How you been? I hope you've been well. Thank you so much for the 20 months of Tier 1. I appreciate it greatly. It feels weird that I've been streaming for even that long. I'm glad to hear you've been doing alright. I've been doing pretty alright myself, uh, if busy. Very, very busy. <laughs> oh no, Ray, whatever will you do? <laughs> Thank you so much for the 19 months, though. I appreciate it greatly. But yeah, what have you been up to, Five Five? You too, Ray. <laughs> what have you also been up to? <laughs> Gosh, please no. After a month away, I don't deserve a train. I know exactly how you feel, Fi Fi. <laughs> The hype train? <laughs> I feel like I've been away for too long. I don't deserve something like that. And I know I'm about to disappear for a little while as well, so that doesn't help either. Thank you so much, Fi Fi, for the five tier ones. <laughs> I appreciate it, but I don't think that'll trigger a train, will it? Yeah, no. <laughs> I appreciate it. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> well, uh, so far, uh, I've been, uh, uh, struggling to remember which way to go. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Thank you for giving another <laughs> gift sub by <five>, five. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Thank you for the hype train. <laughs> Uh, what a thing to come back to, jeez. It's not even been half an hour yet. How's the job been, Ray? I hope it's been uh, decent and satisfactory is a good game. I really should give it another play. I've never heard of Lost Branch of Legends, and video game music is good. <laughs> there really is. It's almost like there's a lot of furries on the internet or something. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what can I say? I, I'm friends with a lot of furries. Because I live with Fang. Pa is, uh... A, a, a friend of mine. A very close friend of mine. Well, not as close, but I know them pretty well. And, uh, Wolf of Armageddon is a friend from a different stream. Yeah, you have. It's interesting how, uh, that works. I, I, do you think maybe the, uh, gift sub algorithm is a little bit biased towards people who have spent more time in a channel? Because that's kind of what it feels like. Makes sense. Well. Yeah. That would be fair. Uh... Hi, buddy. <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> it's nice to see you. Well, let me just remember, see if that works. Yes. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Thank you so much for the 21 months. It's nice to see you again. <laughs> oh, lordy. How was City Skylines? <laughs> I hope you had fun with it. Thank you for the 300 bits, Ray. Y'all, I've been sitting here on this screen for like a good five minutes now. Why are y'all giving me things? <laughs> Apparently, Ray. What did you play then? What you play, putty? <laughs> Unreal Gold. I don't think I've heard of that one. <laughs> Fair. I'm not as old, but I'm decent. <laughs> oh. Oh, is that what happened? I... <laughs> Hold on. There we go. There we go. That's why I did putty, not putty one. <laughs> this game is as old as I am. <laughs>
Uh, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I'm Syrup. I, uh, variety streamer, slime girl, who just plays a lot of indie games because I have a lot of indie games. And, yeah. Um, uh, I've been away for a little bit, and I will be going away pretty soon for a while. But, uh, I'm still happy to see you all here. Nice. I'm happy you got to share that experience with people. I know how you feel. Like, a big part of why I got into streaming is because I wanted to be able to share my experiences like that for games that I really like. So that other people can experience it as well. Now, if I'm leaving you all forever, totally not just going to college for a few years or anything and then coming back. <laughs> yeah, it did end up working out. Despite all of the stress, I have a situation set up where I'll be moving into and going to college for a little. <laughs> We'll see how that goes, though. It'll be a whole new adventure. <laughs> but it should be fun. Or at least interesting. And don't worry, I'll still, I'll still have my server. Which, as you see there, um, I will be posting, like updates and how they, how I'm doing. Make sure you all know I'm not dead in a ditch somewhere. But, uh, yeah. It's nice to see you all. Thank you for coming by. I am, uh, Who knows, Mushy? Who knows? <laughs> but uh, I've been uh, kind of just fumbling through my notes for a little bit, trying to figure out where I'm supposed to be going. Because there's a lot of places with a lot of things. And I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I know I killed the boss guy up here. Yeah, just start over. Yeah. You're not wrong, Mushy. It's definitely a different experience since you're trying to show off of the game instead of just straight up enjoy it but it's still fun in its own way at least to me uh, and my notes are in my discord actually <laughs> I've been uh, <laughs> I've been taking screenshots and posting them into a discord text channel in my server that only myself and Frey can really see because Ray's the one who's been helping me with the game, so I thought might as well let them see my notes. Also, gosh no, I'm gonna I'm trying to beat this game before I have to leave for college. <laughs> I mean, sometimes it's just like that, though. It's really good to see you too, buddy. It's been a while since we chatted. I've actually been in VR a lot more lately, so maybe I'll see you around on there sometime soon. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, is it? <laughs> Specifically La Mulata? It does? It can just be frustratingly confusing every now and then. <laughs> oh, great music. All throughout the game, great music. You are absolutely right, Chaos. <laughs> it did have a randomizer run. It does have a randomizer and... Hmm, I couldn't. I couldn't imagine. Yeah, but you've also played these games a lot, Ray, so you generally know where to go and the general puzzles. While I, on the other hand, am uh, banging my head against a wall <laughs> repeatedly. I mean, with this game, yeah, it makes sense that a, in, that a complicated seed would cause a longer run. Because you need X to solve Y to get to Z to get to, so that you can go to A and just mm, all over the place. Uh... On my maps for Gate of the Dead? Yes, it looks like there's two rooms that I haven't explored. I know I have explored them, but they've not been updated on the maps yet. Oh. Hi, Zelpud. Come on, please. <laughs> I mean, it's not just some average Joe anymore. I'm not going to be making my own food and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> New phone, who dis? God damn it, Zelpa. <laughs> uh, very Zelpa moment. Right, I have the combo button now. Whee! Whee! Um, where am I? I'm in the middle. Yep, the Lava Lava Classic. Up oh, there goes my fairy. Yeah, this is the Dark Star Lord's footprint. There. Then there's down here. Or no, it's the other side that I want to get to. No, 
now. I gotta go down. Ow. Down. Yep. I, I did this puzzle, yeah. Uh, that's... There's a puzzle here that I need to do with a slight weight. I think. But I don't know how to get to the slight weight thing yet. Oh, I have double jump. I totally forgot I had double jump. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is what happens when you stop playing La Mulana for a month and try and get back into it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, I did get that. Uh, I guess for saving another fairy, I could go visit the fairy queen, question mark, see if they have anything new to say. They probably don't, but... Oh, you're new. I don't remember seeing an enemy here the last few times I came here. No, that's the same as last time. I do recognize that text. Uh... Why does the map have those purple lines? Only thing that I can think of is that for the bottom one, it's signifying the transition to a mortal battlefield. But why is there one on the top? Unless it's just because it's a leftover from the bottom because the map wraps around itself like it does uh, in La Milana 1. But the map orientations have been uh, very different from La Milana 1. Like, room shapes and things like that. At least, based off of the map. Uh... <laughs> I remember that we still need a thing. Uh to get past a laser in Valhalla that is being guarded by Nidhogg, I think was the boss, but I don't know how to do any damage to Nidhogg at the moment. I need more seals for just having more seals. Uh... Genuinely, Ray, if you have a hint, it's true, but I never know where to go. Mm -hmm. 
Uh... Wasn't there somebody here wanting something? want uh, a shining sight and then we said I had something that said the shining sight was in the top right room question mark But once I'm actually here, it doesn't look like it leads anywhere just to this thing. Yeah, I might need a warm sweatshirt for this ice water. shop here which I believe has something to do with the bird but I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do with it yes You know, in this area where there's ice on the floor, and then like two rooms down, it's uh, poison lava. <laughs> Just giant bird. Yes, there was frigid water. Right over here. This chest, from what I've come to learn through the achievements that I got from finding it, or one of the other ones, a style chest. Uh, those are these. Langsuir. Vampires transformed from women who died during childbirth. First thing, may seem beautiful, but there are large biting mouths hidden in the backs of their heads, where they feed on blood. Where they feed on blood, they pull back their hair to reveal them. That's what those are. Yeah. 
<laughs> You're kind of woman. And then poison lava! Which there is a room below here. I don't know how to get to it though. Sing, Brita Bray, beauty begins at the foot of you, gaze upon that foot. I believe that's a hint toward the, um, the bird thing. The bird statue up here. Nope, they weren't enough on their own. Not for La Mulana. Not even close to enough. There we go. Wait, this hot string will make your skin as smooth as an egg. It'll be so smooth that it'll be impervious to even water and lava. Yes, please. <laughs> right, I promise not to peek, so go on in. Now am I actually, like... Immune to the poison water and lava? Fuck. Let's see. Would you look at that? Sweet. <laughs> is that a permanent buff? I sure hope it is. Just checking these spaces. Ow. For breakable floors and stuff. Because you never know with this game. Vidofnir. Uh, we have fought Vidofnir already. Yeah, I think. No, we haven't fought them yet. Um, but we do have some notes about him. My best guess is that I need that and that. Yeah, I'm glad to have seen you again and heard from you, Fi Fi. It's always nice to see you. 
thank you so much. I'll see you next time, hopefully. Yeah, sleep well, Fi Fi. Get me back up here. There's only one other place that I can think of where it wants me to do this. Their way. I'm trying that again from the top. It's gonna let me from here. Uh, it should from the other side. Still don't know how to kill those skeletons. Okay, it wasn't a permanent buff. Sad. No? Assuming that uh, I don't have the things that I need for that yet. All right, buddy, it was nice to see you too. Hope you sleep well. So this says Vidovnir lives at Yggdrasil's peak, at the treetop's highest point, which the tree is upside down, so it would be at the lowest point, which makes sense why, if we look at the map, there is that one point down there with the uh, door. Uh... Honestly, what, Dre? Oh. Uh, 
Of course. Because that's just my luck, huh? Not my fault at all. Now. Mm -hmm. Might as well do this, get the buff as well, since from the looks of things, uh, the boss is gonna have uh, lava powers. There you go. Come on, I have the shield up. Let me up there! Well... Uh... Rude. There we go. Oh, I don't have the buff. Flame. Healing fairy. There we go. You'll have to make do. Uh... Okay, that buff is definitely a lot more powerful and useful. Just, uh... So what I'm gonna do is this. Do th let that go. Go back up here. Save here. So that's where I respawn. Go through here. It's fine if I take damage. Alright, Ray. I remember you mentioning uh, you were going to go play a game with some friends. So I hope that's fun. Here. 
boss hard. All right, thank you so much, Mushy. I hope you sleep well when you do go to sleep. It was nice seeing you again, and I hope to see you again soon, hopefully. So I have exactly enough, oh well, almost exactly enough to uh, get this exactly every single time I come back, or reload, I should say. As long as I don't read that t tablet. Its head deals damage, but not its body, so got more information, but it's also spamming projectiles way too fast. Oh. I forgot I have double jump again. So much help. Uh, I'll try and take it from afar. Because that'll help, probably. There we go. Damage! <laughs> I hope it's dealing damage. It's hard to tell. Uh, I should save at least five.
here. Ow. Ah, that was my fault. Because Chang, the weird jumping physics. Once more from the top. Ow. Out of here. Very. And then I burn up. It's really hard to tell if you're making any leeway with the way this game's health, boss health bars are like. I'm at least not getting the sound effect that means I'm doing no damage. Remember that the head has a hurt box. What do you mean? There I go.
so hard to get consistent damage on this wiggly guy. Part of me wishes I had the gun. Also, there's one of the programs I currently have equipped, or the combination of some of the programs I have equipped, just gives me the health fairy every time. Lava keeps making it hard to keep it consistent. so hard to get any damage in. Well, any consistent damage, I should say. But that is just kind of this game. And I know I'm very rusty when it comes to how it plays. is mean. Oh 
getting bullied! What's with this series and its jerk birds? There I go. Ray, why'd you give me games with jerk birds in them? Why'd you encourage me to play these? <laughs> I love birds, but this game, it makes me question them. <laughs> Messing with me is that you can swim in the streams of lava that he throws up. Also, getting the fairy really does help, even if it's a trek to get to. Just dealing with this guy and his projectiles is enough, but they had to throw in the lava too. This is probably doing no damage, but...
part of me wishes I knew how to get the uh, treasure fairy to get out consistently so I could grind some money so I could go buy the gun. God would definitely make this fight a lot easier. I'm genuinely surprised I've gotten as far as I have, though, without the gun. Whenever I'm forced to swim through the jets of lava, it put, makes me put my guard down. See, that would have been blocked norm like normal, but the lava makes me swim and I can't block while swimming. You know what? Just use all my flares on it. I don't care if I need them for puzzles later. And you can't even tell if I've made a dent! Isn't the blue shine normal? I can't remember. It's usually a sound effect that uh, tells me that if I can't uh, hurt something, I'm pretty sure. But I could be wrong. Really? He drops coins. <laughs> it says uh, he cannot be harmed with ordinary weapons, so I guess I need something special. Do I have a special weapon? I don't think I have that special weapon.
I mean, do the last thing that I can think of, which I highly doubt, is, uh... Lightning? So I can't do this boss, but I haven't covered it, at least. Um, I don't believe I have any notes on what the weapon I need for beating them is. I believe I've already finished that puzzle. Not sure what I need to do now. Because I did find a path, I just can't do anything with it.
so I need to... I found that I need to, uh... get the destiny... And to be able to get the destiny tablet, I need the time... the ability to stop time. So that I can fight Anzu, the Lord of Beasts that stops time. And once I beat them, then I get the Destiny Tablet. Which is the ancient cog that lets me stop time. I don't have the life and chaos mantras. So I can't do that puzzle. Place that holds Mimir as well, that it ha has a well of divine liquor, which to get to it, I need to howl for that which is missing. Do I need to use the word moon in that area? Or the mantra moon? Um. somewhere in here because this is where I got the uh, thing the note for it That's not lightning, that's a laser. Am I getting zapped? I'm not getting zapped. Uh, I need the map, but I don't know where the map is. I know there's an eye behind this breakable wall here, but I don't know how to get this chest. Ow. 
now. You do, yeah. Stone tablet on which allegiance to the Anunnaki was pledged with the power to star sealed inside. Yes, I get this, but I need to get the destiny tablet, which is what you're talking about. And I need to be able to stop time to be able to get that. And it says Anzu is on the other side of the spiraling light, which the spiraling light is the thing that I need, or is the thing blocking me, which I get past by having the thing that uh, Nidhogg is guarding. I think it's on Zoo Hat. Who's the time one? The cog of ancient times lies with the twins. It will be revealed by the accumulated power of ancient storms. Okay, so I have the thing for the ancient storms. Where are the twins? Or at least the twins that it is speaking of. it has a very specific graphic and I'm not seeing that graphic or that shape anywhere. Are these twins that it is talking about? I don't believe I've come across the celestial disc either. You know, I believe I have the mantra heaven. I do. Oh, 
Oh, wait. So it's in Heaven's Labyrinth, the destiny wheel, or the celestial disc, but we can't get deeper into the, the, uh, into Heaven's Labyrinth yet because of something that I don't remember that we needed to do. I don't know if I've gotten this illuminating ring of power. Which the only one that I can think of that I've gotten something like that is the chakrams. I finished that puzzle. Oh, I should keep it there, though. Until I've actually killed it. Get rid of that one. in the feather. So I see a thread. I see a thread of what I need to do. However, I don't know where the start of that thread is. Battlefield. did see a note about finding a pillar that looks like the, uh... <laughs> the, uh, Thor's hammer Mjolnir. And I need to strike it with lightning. I don't know where that would be, though.
Uh, I feel like I've done that one already. I'm done. Have I gotten a thing for Balor? Uh, doesn't look like it. Of course, I'm guessing Balor is after Nidhogg, who I don't have the Nidhogg's thing either. So I can't exactly look into Nidhogg. Gold-plated giant. I have a feeling he is past that swirling light, which I've done. The, I've done the things that I needed to do to awaken him. I'm pretty sure, at least. But I can't get to him yet. Divine Fortress Liquor Path. Where the heck is that? Uh, let's go here real quick so that we can heal up. Fine Fortress. Okay, this is the antechamber. Oh, I forgot to turn that off. Still antechamber. Sanctum path. seal Who knew it? Can 
air seal still. Ship remind me I have a useful item that's been left just sitting in my home, so I made it so that you can open the treasure chest. I really dislike that enemy. I can just jump up here now. That was the item that gave me Kafka's Ow. Finally get to this other side though. Read this. That is the medicine of the eternal life sought after by countless deities. A gift of paradise, it restores life after death. The horn blast of the end disappears into the wind of they who wish for eternity. Night continues for eternity toward the child's roar left by the mother. I thought I told you to shush. Uh, define. Soma. There we go. Nope. Oh, getting out of there.
so that's the lotus thing. I'm pretty sure. But I need life and chaos. Which I have neither. Star Lord's footprint, liquor path, antechamber. I don't know where Mimir's well is. Also, the liquor pack. Is this where the note is? Yeah. So, there's still some puzzle here, I think. this block I could be wrong about the mantra though that I'm supposed to use uh, I guess it could also be somewhere in Valhalla Because these, these are the people of Odin. Room, treasury. The treasury have a hint to wear.
fire altar. Fire altar. It's also this place that I can't actually get to the guy for the power altar, Ugh, which I'm still missing a seal for. Welcome back, Ray. Have I stumbled around enough for you to uh, be okay with helping me? I mean, yes, but still. Potato, potato, no? Nothing. I can't do anything here because that door's not open. Which I believe if to open it, I need to do the things and the stuff and the air. Eh. That's the pillar bearing the uh, Mjolnir. Cool, so I have that puzzle figured out.
Oh jeez. That was a sequence of events. That's raised slightly. It probably was just something that was a pressure plate and opened that path down there, but still. Hi, Snowy. It's nice to see you. Thank you so much for the 13 months. How are you doing? Jealous? I want curly fries. But I want curly fries. That's the hint about the twins, but I don't know where the twins are. It's true, I can't have those. Well, that's a secret. Secrets of the Underworld and the Underworld. There's a fairyman called Charon. He was once punished for allowing a living poet to cross, blah blah blah. For a single coin. He'll let you pass. And that's blocking the way. I don't have the map for here yet, so I can't check the names for places. Huh. That does seem pretty popular for a stream day. Yeah, I did watch somebody play that already. Scott's playing Pikmin 4. Not that surprised about that. That came out like two days ago. That is neat, yes. Weapon 
shelter, which I've got the weapon. <laughs> also, this message, Snowy. Uh, I think you'll enjoy it. <laughs> Ow. Sacred wine corridor. Corridor spikes. I need you heal. <laughs> Yep, I guess so. <laughs> Nothing I want now. Felpa, do you have anything new for me? <laughs> Looks like I'm all alone. Well, this is how it used to be anyway, but I'm still a happy guy. No, it is <laughs> close enough. <laughs> oh, it's only 200 for the pistol? I thought it was 300 for the pistol. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you're not wrong, Ray. Oh, he's not here. But that's blocked still. Where'd he go? things from here. Where'd the guy go? I'm not sure if it'll take Snowy. I think you're just being hopeful. Never sky disc. <laughs> Zebu. I get this now. Sean Kosuki. Who the heck? Oh, the grandfather. Uh, 
that's the save point one. Interesting that you can stand on the arm. But you can't stand on the leg of the other one. Pretty sure you could jump on that. And that one as well. <laughs> That's funny. Is that not something to be picked up? It looked like a tag thing or glossary things. No one's here, right? Yeah. Should I make that a redeem as well, Snowy? With how much I uh, deny it. Snowy, that do you know how little that narrows it down? <laughs> when it's you speaking, in particular. You know exactly what I'm talking about, too. <sighs> Nothing new there other than the guy disappearing. Let's see if Moldbrook has anything for us. No, but you show me a lot of things. Just in general, so they all blur together. Uh, defeated in a way that doesn't involve weapons, like you have to solve riddle first. You have to attack it mentally, maybe? Or maybe you have to squash it. But how do I do that? been down in the ruins for a while now, huh? Can you at least r read the text in the ruins? Each character used for numerals in the text in La Mulana had its own meaning. You know, they're written on the sigils you have, too. Check it out. The pattern looking stuff drawn out in the origin seal, that's one in La, M in La Mulana numerals. One is origin, two is birth, three is life, and four is death. And I forgot the rest. This feels kind of important, so I'm just going to go ahead and nap this. And... Birth, life, death.
good. And she's out. No, you're not. It's being slow for me as well. There was something that I did to get similar statues to move. I don't remember why. Weird. So I need to switch the squish this guy, but I don't know how. This room, I did something to get that statue to raise, but I don't remember what. Oh, it was a seal that I had to break. That's what happened, so it's not something I can really do. I might, the other one would be the toad, and I did figure out squishing that guy. I figured that out on my own. I see a series of events that I need to do. I don't know how to get that series of events started though, and it's frustrating. Uh, I'm gonna poke around here for just some for to satisfy some curiosity. didn't even want to go there. Excuse me. I tried to avoid it too. I knew it was coming. Apparently, barely touched that lip and killed me. I'm 
not able to get up there yet. Oh, wait. Entrance to Yake the Desil, the World Tree. Those without the Mother's Power must undo the locking mechanism to proceed. What is the locking mechanism? I won't lie, I'm a little scared of falling into that pit there. This way? No. Because it just looks like a soft block to me is all. Sure is. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. There are new enemies here. There's something about this room. I got an item in this room already. Thanks for the head pat redeem. Uh, boop. If 
There you go. I still have no idea where I need to be going. The main thing I kind of know what to look for is where the twins lie. But the only place where there's two twin statues is in Icefire Treetop, and I don't think those are considered as twins. And they're in a room I can't even access completely yet. Which I have at least one of the things for this. I don't know what this area's obsession is with all of these, uh, golden things and protecting them. Ow. You definitely weren't there before. Or at least not that I remember. Damn jerk birds. Yes, please.
boss was. I have no idea what you could mean. The only inkling I have is maybe trying to mess with the corridor of blood while in from here. Apparently, getting to the, the corridor of blood. Uh, it's apparently a pain here to get there from the tablet. Another crystal skull. Ooh. So helpful for progress. Uh, nothing new or useful there. Try to frost giants. That's blocked off.
Ray, it's been too long that a super vague hint like that will get me nowhere, unfortunately. I have no idea where the dead ends that I think are are anymore. It's been way too long. I'm sorry that the hint isn't really being doing its job. At least for me. Oh, I died. Because my health was low and I forgot about it. still something to do in this room apparently, but I'm not sure what. Definitely no way for me to get there from here. Get out of here. What was in here? A shop. Out here is just the boss that I can't do. Oh, 
I mean, it looks like a thing from one of the tablets. Something about the liquor and for howling what for what is missing. I only have one other idea of what I might have to do, and if it is that, then it's stupid. Um. Getting this and then going through the spiral light in Valhalla. Because technically I can currently withstand both the uh, cold and heat. this works, I'm going to be upset. That is stupid. And it's a dead end, even. Where is Ancient Chaos? Oh, is there just an item that gives you fire and ice immunity later on? deal with that guy because he's in an obnoxious place. Why did I get the bad sound effect? Oh. I see why I got the bad sound effect. <laughs> yeah. That's gonna be a pain to fight. Because I need to climb that stupid tower every single time.
up. <laughs> There's nothing I can really do here. <laughs> I keep getting frozen. And I don't have the ability to stop time currently, so... <sighs> I at least summoned that boss? where that light would be. Just one more place. But because I died, I'm gonna need to grab it again. Judging by your response, it is not the intended way of getting past those lasers. I mean, I guess, but the way you said it and the way the game says it, it should be an item that I have that lets me just be immune because that's just a temporary thing. Fairyland. Chakra Nemo. Your sincere desire to rip me off has created my rage. <laughs> Angel Shield. Angel Shield would be nice, but stupid expensive. It's probably even better than the Silver Shield, in which it never gets knocked out of your hand or something. <sighs> Is there anywhere else? I got that one. try and make it to the spiral light here before my buff wears out. See if I can poke around there a little bit more. Because that is clearly the way, but it could be that since I'm not doing it the way that was intended, 
aka using the item, the wall isn't going away. Alright, enjoy whatever game you're going to be playing, which was probably Remnant 2, knowing you. I need to get up there somehow to press that pressure plate. The only way to do that is to come from the other side. Which I don't know how to get to that other side. Especially considering this is as far as I can go this way. Since I can't get past that there, there's no way up from here. Uh, go ahead, Ray. I'm sorry to hear snowing. Angie Fox. Yep. <laughs> just be a little patient, Snowy. I'm sure it'll turn out just fine. All right, go ahead, Ray. It's fine, Snowy. Nah, it'll be fine. <laughs> it's okay, it just means you can hang out with us here for a little longer. I figured... It's probably a screen transition to it from somewhere else, but I don't know where. That's the problem. Uh, sure.
You go ahead and do that, Snowy. Which is in that area I can't access anyway, because the only way that I can see to get up higher currently is through that one room in which it's a push door one way and a bread tax door the other. The only other idea I could have is that it has something to do with the sword spike and giant nail thing, but I don't, I have no clue what it could be. And if that's not it, it probably means that it's a different area transition into that area than uh, you'll be able to get there from somewhere else. There's no other doors there. So that means there is a way to get up to top right. I um Ice Fire not Ice Fire Tree Top uh Shrine of the Frost Giants from Shrine of the Frost Giants. Oh there you are. I was wondering where you went. The only clue that I can think of is something about make, filling in an empty column. sure what column I could be talking about. Smashed world cross, his awakening will melt even the eternal wall of ice. Yeah, cool. Nope. That just hurts. Does this place have two of those totem prayer things? Because there's one in a room where it's showing the uh, scene transition door and an NPC door, but it's not showing it there. Where am I right now? 
I'm in a secret area. Oh, it's not lightning. It shows it to be snow here, but it's not acting like snow there for some reason. Okay, Ray, can you answer me this question? Do I have the items that I would need to be able to get into that top right area? And do I have the knowledge I need to get into that top right area? So I have the items. I don't know if I have the uh, knowledge yet. I also don't know if I've been in the room that I need to go to for, for it. Look at that, this this pillar is actually showing reflections. I just had a silly idea that if it works, I'm gonna 
be mildly upset. It's not that. Okay. I still don't know what I need the pepper for. Yes, how do I break the pillar, though? I don't have any explosives. is just hitting a wall several times. I tried striking that wall up and down a ton. I apparently missed it. Uh, see. Woo, new mantra. Apparently. Just my luck, huh? From Balor's back erupt the seeds of hellfire. <laughs> Both. Now I have the sea mantra. Uh, acceptance into the fire guild lies at the ice fire tree talk to the, on the five pillars of ice. Done that. Um, key. I killed an enemy with the Mimic. Red tax, red tax. Let's see. Oh, so I'm, uh, yeah, it is just me, I'm blind.
at least I have the progress now. One of. I just hope it actually helps. Get me out there. of piled soil rests atop Sakit's prison. It will open by the words of Sakit's former association. I don't know what he used to be referred to as, but I don't think it's important. Apparently. <laughs> I, I don't think it is. <laughs> yeah, clearly. I've, I don't think it expected me to get behind the boss. sure if I have the thing I need to kill it because I need something that creates hellfire and I don't believe I have anything like that. I can try again and try attacking its face. is the face. We did it again. You know what? There you go. It's fine. <laughs> I it would sure make the boss easier if I could. <laughs> Oh, 
I'm sorry, Sonoe. Great. Ow. It happened again! There you go. Didn't do enough damage. <laughs> or didn't do any damage. Excuse you. Ah! The fuck? That was new. I know, right? How dare it? Laser. Punch. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to avoid that. There's only one way that I can see it. And it's super risky. But it involves doing this, basically. Thank you. 
take a laser. Big laser. Almost made it. I almost did it. There we go. <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you! <sighs> that was disrespectful. Like, I know other bosses have done it, but fuck you. Uh, the boss, after I killed it, decided, you know what, let's launch the salvo of missiles as I'm dying. To immediately annihilate you. Now what? Uh. Valor is now dead. Well, I killed him, but I'm not getting anything for it. The state changed, but... I mean, is this a path, actually? Okay.
So that's a boss killed. I do not know what I need to do to open that chest, though. You know what? I doubt I've seen that word before. Hello? Fire? I don't know what I need to do here to get that chest open. <laughs> but... I'm guessing... Whatever's in that chest gives me a, the thing that lets me pass through the swirling light. exactly have sky I have heaven After, uh, I didn't. I I'm guessing. Because I can't see anything else to do here. So I'm just... mentioned a few times around the place. I I'm just, but yeah, I'm just full on guessing right now.
Well, I can always do my trick. Of, since I have more than 50 gold, I can go down to that, uh... What's it called? Okay. There is something up here, though. There we go. Clay doll outfit. Resistant to heat, water, and polluted air, though this comes at the cost of being extremely heavy. Of course! It's me we're talking about. Oh, we get a little laser beam. Uh, but before we go... <laughs> Too chonky to run. <laughs> door brings us to Valhalla. The Kamandalu water pot is tolerance. It is the vessel which will tolerate any battle that provokes chaos. is power altar. Oh, actually, I'm curious. Do I still take that image from fireballs? I do, but barely. I've got food! Uh... Yeah, food. <laughs> A child's heart sleeps in the spiral boat. The spiral depths are nestled within the deeper, darker depths of the heat. The heart. Child's heart is the final gate. Is this still power altar? It is.
And I got a drink. Good thing, too, because I did finish my other hydration recently. Okay, we have that shortcut open. Uh, it doesn't do all too much for us, though. Because we can't get over into that middle bit. Well, we can, kind of. But even if we did, we don't have the last seal that we need, or the sigil, that we need to get whatever item is there, which I'm guessing is the weapon that I need to use to kill the boss in Icefire Treetop, which will then let me do something. But uh, give me a second. I need, I'll be right back. Uh, so uh, enjoy the music. And I'm back. Sorry about that little delay. Also, um, 
the description of the thing, the garb, uh, makes me think of something, which I'm not sure if it'll be true. Probably won't be, but we'll see. But I'm going to eat a tiny bit first. Um, ice fire tree top. Drop the sage. I mistimed it. Traces of poison. Cool. It does work. Yup. Acquired. It is said once that the Jotun have destroyed Yggdrasil in collaboration with the Ninth Children. The end will come. The Ninth Children, born from the deepest depths of Eglana, is a manifestation of Eglana's fury and was created for the purpose of total annihilation. able to get to this chest, I can't open it. But I have a gun now! I have a projectile weapon! This is infinite! I don't care if it's very little damage, it's still better than nothing! I have lasers now. While I'm specifically in this outfit. Take it off for now. I am giving something a try. Because this is an unconventional weapon. said conventional weapons wouldn't hurt it, so... Nope. Oh well, it's worth a try. So we have that now. 
I'm not sure where else it would be useful. <laughs> I'm also eating a little bit now, so now that I have beaten a boss. can go through the laser beams in which I've gone through all of the ones that I know about. Or the spiral lights, I should say. Do you have anything new to say, Muldbrook? Nope. I actually wonder if Zelda has anything to say about the outfit. Nothing to do with my hair, but Alcidana has been looking pretty bad recently. I'm kind of worried. Who? Yes. The Klana must be sealed off long, long ago when the mother, Long Light itself, fell to this planet and wanted to return to the sky. However, its child, Eglana, born here in this land, has no such desire. We don't know when it will use its power to destroy us. Mankind must not be forced to live under the fear of destruction. We must strive to improve ourselves and press on toward the unknown future. So that was new dialogue at least. Still up here. What was through here? Okay. Nothing. There's also something. I missed. So uh, I'm gonna go grab that real quick. It's over in Infinite Corridor. Or I should say the no longer very Infinite Corridor. <laughs> It's just a, uh, what's it called? A glossary entry, but I still want to grab it. I did see it, I just forgot that you actually have to interact with the red ones to pick them up. There we go. Freya, Freya, queen of the fairies, sought the assistance of the four philosophers for her plan to destroy the Lamamana ruins. She apparently used to live in Eglana, which she also intends to seal off. 
After Lamalana was destroyed, she hid away in the ruins to protect the fairies. Okay. So we have that now, but I don't know where else it gives us access to. It doesn't look like I have any notes on Fenrir. <laughs> or at least no labeled notes. Uh, what was the thing with the mantras that I needed? That I needed C. Sun, Moon, and C. Path to the Underworld. Uh, a, a long path to the bottom of the earth. Uh, oh, it's probably that one area. Okay. I think I know where you need to go. out of here. Is that not it? I thought for sure that'd be the way in. You know, this being Gate of the Dead and all that. <laughs> Gate of the Dead leading to Underworld. This, that makes sense, right? I mean, it does to me, but that's just general knowledge, or general logic, not La Mulana logic. Blood leads to the underworld. Dangerous pitfall. <laughs> Which 
way is the easiest. Valhalla. This is not the right one. Was it this one? I don't think it was this one. Not the one I had in mind. one I had in mind either. I know the one that's over here is set up for it. Oh wait, can I get to that gate from here? No. So I need to go back to... Valhalla's gate. Try to remember which orientation it was for. Uh, Shrine of the Frost Giants. I hope it was this one. Yeah, which means through here. It leads to the sealed one. Yeah! I did it! New area! Eternal Prison Doom. What was that achievement I just got? Finally reached the underworld. I cannot use my uh, Holy Grail here. Interesting. I mean, I guess it makes sense. But come on, you agree with the logic at least, right, Ray? That the underworld would be past the gate of the dead? I guess.
impressive dig. Danger combustible gas. Oh my. That doesn't sound healthy. Gigantic monster that takes the form of an eagle. Watcher Veglana. Trial Civigar sees through the eyes of its other self. Ratan Ratatoskir. And is actually in hibernation while Ratatoskir is active. They decided Ratatoskir should be sealed up. Rail Sevigar shall awaken. Hey, it's for Rail Sevigar. Ah! Enemies are so chonky here! Figured. What the fuck? Okay. You're not what I was expecting. I was expecting to have a talk with an NPC, not end up in an entirely different area. I should have healed back up, whatever. Give me your data. Is a pot. Oh, that's a big ball of hands and faces. Ow, that was spikes that are hidden. Rama asked Amendo Ikanat Nushi uh, what is creation? Amaterasu illuminated all with a red light that lives the lives born from that are creation. Eternal prison do. Oh, it's just one of those. It's the DVD logo thing. I'm gonna wait for it here. I don't trust that pedestal. So hello. I am Neti, former guard of the Otherworld. While you must pass through seven gates, as has been lost since ancient times, the order in which you must pass through changes with each Underworld deity. However, the words signifying this order have not changed. The order is Divine Chalice, Golden Gleaming Wrist Guard, Lunar Breastplate, Rustic Clothing, Golden Wings, Something Repurposed, and a Glove of Power. The gates reconstructed by Hell are each inscribed with a different crest. 
I do not know which crests signify which words. the rest out for yourself. Inspect the gates yourself to see the crests. The Lord's throne that is sent to Nibiru is in the Dark Star Lord's Pyramid. The words needed to climb the throne are hidden in the footprints, or in footprints, footprints concealed by the Dark Star Lord. I know this already. Oh, is it? Careful. Map. There I go being super careful, huh? have gotten that information. <laughs> A carefully placed pot, apparently. After I died, I realized something that I could have done to save myself, but it was too late for that. Thank you for the hug, Ray. Remember that one time I glitched out of bounds? I turned you off. Yeah, that sure happened. things all over again. Now, 
Get out of here. Give me. Excuse me. You're in the way, sir. The Duat room and the room of judgment go hand in hand. No life can be guaranteed to those who do not possess the proof of judgment. That guy only attacks backwards, which is weird. That's a way out. That's a bracelet. I know that's a bracelet. That is the glove of power, actually. Which is the last one we need. So of course we find the last one first. Wouldn't that just be my luck, huh? Stepping through a gate where what you hold is stolen will be counted, but step through a gate where it's not, and we shall not. Time to do it all over again. I should have just dipped so that I could have saved progress.
so that I'd still have the map and all of those glossary entries. That again. Grab that. I want to read the glossary for that. An Olympian monster with numerous heads and arms. The hideous creature was locked away in the underworld. It was used to assist with the slaughter of the second children. Now he loiters around as a guard of the eternal prison. So I don't need to wait for it later. There's something up with this stone. on the spikes. Cheater. I forgot to read this one. Okay, now I'm going down. wrong. I know what two of them are. Uh... Well, it has to be this one, but I'm gonna go through this one. Which this one is the Golden Wings. Which is the third one. Oh, it just spits me out somewhere random. I wish it wasn't so much of a trek, you know? Not that the distance to it is long, it's just... 
a lot. It's not a hard path to get back to, it's just a lot of doors and loading zones. I hope I won't need to do this path multiple times. But, uh... Oh, that wasn't the first one? So then it was the one on the top right. Well, middle right, I should say. Drive safe! Well... Might as well heal up. I have a chance to do it right now. Like, I wish they gave us one of those totem checkpoints. Just right at the start of the area. That'd be a nice quality of life. That was a waste. Okay, go on this way. No, they took my gloves. My climby gloves. I feel like setting off a flare in this area would be a very bad idea. Oh. 
Well. It sure is one of those. Just so that I don't have to go and sit and wait for the health recharge again. Food all done. Also, I am not enjoying these guys. These uh, brain things with their floating spikes. I've had enough bullet health to deal with. I've been playing Rabby Ribby again. played Rabby Ribby, right, Ray? Uh, I'm not sure. I don't think so. Or at least they're working on it. Um, I know that I'm still trying to get through the is the order a DLC or a DLC. That's what it is. A rage filled face warped with murderous intent. They who wield excessive power. doesn't have anything on it. Death awaits you if you descend below. I don't think I should. Uh, what's it called? F write that one down? Because it's pretty straightforward. Her 
a child born to the trickster of the six children. Half of her body was dead and rotted from birth. Due to this irregularity, she was chosen to be ruler of the underworld. With the end approaching, she has strengthened her hold on the underworld and is able to return those who have fallen to the underworld back to the world of the living. Bone hand. What do you mean? That was poison gas, no? Oh, I, I blinked and missed it. I didn't see what happened. Did I get launched by the door? It's not that big of a deal. Get out of here. Fuck you, game. That's just rude. That was weird. trying to get past you. What a health refill. Okay, I got that. 
Oh, fuck. Have I hit a dead end? Or at least, can I no longer progress? I mean, I can go back up, but I don't know if that would change anything. From a gameplay perspective, this area has not been all that fun. Like, I... The concept is neat, but it's just the game bullying, you know? That was a sound. I can't go down. That doorway eats me. Which basically leaves only one path. Nope. I mean, I'm fine with it. Means I can go save all of the progress I made for information and collection. But I don't know where to go from there. I have one idea, and it's to try to go in the death door without the suit on. But if that is, but I don't know why that would be the solution.
Oh wow, I'm real close to getting the health refill. Ow. <clears throat> it's fine. As long as I can get over here. Uh, I didn't want to use that yet. I do not understand. Yep, it just... It kills me. I am not sure how to progress anymore. <clears throat> Is it that I don't have all the items I need? Tunnel visioning. Now, do you mean tunnel visioning specifically into hell? Or the underworld? Or a, an area in the underworld? And I'm not surprised if it's me going to uh, the underworld, the eternal prison, is the tunnel visioning because I like exploring new areas when I come across them. Figured it was just one branch, but like I assumed going through all the going through the gates would get me to the other branches. Like here gets me to this area. I 
anything, so... Now, if I've visited all the rooms without dying between them is a different story. The only room that I actually no, I I'm pretty sure I visited all of the rooms. But I mean, I can double check. Statue. Oh, I haven't been in that left area, but that's because it squishes me. So that top right one is a trick, is what you're selling me. Like, it lets you go through, but it's a trap. Areas have different maps because, of course, they do. Yeah, 
Dura de C was turned to stone for breaking the code of the underworld. The last thing she hears is a song close to her heart. The song of paradise played by her husband. Hello? Hey you, you want secret fairy? Money, give it. Sure. 400 gold input shit complete. This is it. Key fairy! We got the last fairy! Hey yo, shit, I finally got my ass out of here. What the hell took you so long? And who the hell are you, by the way? I'm here, Heria. The fairy. I'm the secret finding key fairy. Okay then, where are the secrets? Give me the secrets! Hurry up and take me to them, damn it! A part of me wants to go to Anufin. See if there's secrets in there with the key, but I don't know. I don't know any place in particular that would have the secrets. Oh, that's Eurydice on the left. out of the way. It's fine. Got through. Last gate to hell has endured several eras. The gate's decoration was done by hell's hand. The unadorned gates are also gates to hell. First gate will take something from your person. Wrong one. Yes. There's probably a faster way by going to the Eternal Chaos second location where there's the totem save thing.
but eh. oh, it is that time, isn't it? Yeah, we. I probably shouldn't. I should probably go do some other things. But that being said, I'd say for having lost track of everything. I'm surprised at how much, uh, how much progress we ended up making. Like, genuinely. But, uh, yeah. Let us switch to here. And see who's live. If there's anyone fun online or at least that I feel like throwing y'all over to eh, not particularly so I'll just call it here but uh yeah I want to thank you all for coming by um, I'm still unsure if I'm gonna play more of this or if I'm gonna switch to something else on Friday I am thinking I will probably do more of this because look at how empty this item screen is. But there's a lot that we're missing and I have only a handful of streams left before I have to put this game on hold for a long time. Oh, that is unless I finish it on my own, which I'm not sure you all would want that. I'm not sure if I would want that because then I wouldn't have Ray's help. But that being said, I want to thank you all for coming to hang out. I appreciate it greatly. I appreciate all the subs, gift subs, everything you've all done. I appreciate every last bit of it. And I hope to see you next time. Good night, everybody.